what's this all about with the vertical number line? Let's check it out and see how to set it up. We're going to practice using the number 736, and we're going to round 736 to the nearest 100. So the first thing I need to do are find my hundreds that are going to go on the bottom and the top of my number line. To find my first hundred, I'm going to look at the first digit in the number I'm rounding. That first digit is a seven. So I'm, I'm going to start with the number 700. That is going to go on the bottom of my number line. So 700 will go on the bottom of my number line. Now, to find my next number, I'm going to count up by 100 to get the number for the top. So 100 more than 700 is 800. So that's going to go on the top of my number line. Now, I need to find the number halfway between 700 and 800. And I know that the number halfway between 0 and 100 is 50. So I'm going to take my 50 and I'm going to add the hundreds digit from my bottom number to the 50 to come up with my halfway number, which for this is 750. Now I'm going to place 736 on the number line. 736 is more than 700, but it's less than 750. So it's going to come down here. Once I've placed my number on the number line, I need to round it. So I know that this is my halfway point. And anything, anything below my halfway point is going to stay the same. And anything above my halfway point is going to round up to the next 100. So since 736 is below the halfway point of 750, it's going to stay at 700. So 736 rounds to 700. Now you try it.